Well, today, Grand Traverse County Commissioners were given notice of a special meeting with Leelanau County Commissioners and the Northwest Regional Airport Authority. In a memo, Cherry Capital Airport CEO Kevin Klein says the NRAA believes it's time to expand the airport. Our Allie Baxter spoke to Klein. She joins us now live from outside the airport. Allie. Mark, this is a very rough draft of what those expansion plans could look like. But as Klein tells me, it could look completely different. The building was designed and handled about half the about number of passengers are today. So at our very peak times of the year, um, the passenger experience is very crowded. And so we want to make sure we can uh, adjust those and keep that small town feel. A potential expansion could be coming to Cherry Capital Airport but it's still too early to know what exactly that expansion could look like. We're really at the beginning and it's very early in the process. And so, you know, design concepts are coming forward, financial plan, it's all coming together. Very many things can change. Ideas right now include five new gates, a bigger TSA checkpoint and baggage area, more restrooms, dining, and... We're looking to have information sessions with the public to get their feedback on the amenities and things that they want. Klein says the total price tag could be up to $120 million. There's no plans to do a millage for it. Instead, Klein explains funding will be through bonds, grants, and governmental dollars. If you use the airport, you'll pay for it through your taxes that are on those tickets. An expansion of the airport has been talked about before. It was part of a master plan done in 2006. Where we can go, what we need to do, how we can make those amenities stronger. And the best part about it is we can expand without impacting anybody else. You know, we're gonna look to expand to the east of the facility here, which was planned for in the original designs of this. Are there any concerns with potentially expanding? Um, you know, from the standpoint of the facility itself, there isn't, you know, it's not, it's not really being expanded. So under the FAA world, it's not you build something to attract more service. You can only build things to handle the current volume of what's happening now. So we're building for today's volume. We're already seeing it. The impacts are already happening. Um, we're now just building to accommodate that. The expansion won't be possible unless Grand Traverse and Leelanau County support it. That will be discussed in a meeting coming up in October. We're live in Traverse City tonight. Allie Baxter, Up North Live News.